Arab billionaires and their royal lifestyles. Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed The Crown Prince, also known as Fasa, is one of the wealthiest royals in the world with a net worth of $400 million. It is not surprising that the prince has lavish tastes given that he was raised in a considerably wealthier environment. He owns luxury tanks, amphibious vehicles, and millions of dollars worth of exotic animals, including the priciest horses and camels in the world. The royal family has numerous luxury estates all around the world, giving the prince a wide range of choices when it comes to opulent residences. The cost of the Regal Zabiel Palace could reach $500 million. To get away from life in Dubai he owns a $55 million penthouse in Vancouver, Canada. Because of all the exotic animals he owns, the prince has earned the reputation of being an enthusiast with animals. Tigers, elephants, lions, and numerous elegant peacocks are among the animals in his collection. Perhaps nothing is more amazing than his camel? which he brought at a cost of $2.7 million, it is said to be the most expensive camel in the world. In addition, he is the owner of thousands of horses valued at about $1.85 million each, along with hundreds of falcons. He also has a flashy golden Rolls Royce Phantom in his expensive car collection, which is valued at a staggering price of $8.2 million. Prince Al-Walid bin Dalal he is a member of the Saudi royal family and the nephew of the late King Abdullah. One of the richest people in the world, Prince Al-Walid bin Dalal is thought to have a net worth of an astounding $19 billion. He is undoubtedly one of the wealthiest people in the Middle East and the richest individual in Saudi Arabia. Knowing that he must have amazing residences, there are actually three that belong to the monarch instead of just one two of which are already in operation, while a third is being built. He resides in the Kingdom Palace, a 250,000 square foot castle in the heart of Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. The palace is surprisingly valued at $130 million and has personal chefs who can feed 2,000 people with an hour's notice and work in four separate kitchens. One for Asian cuisine, one for continental food, one for Arab cuisine, and the fourth kitchen is used for sweets. Visitors can unwind in the lagoon-shaped pool while watching a movie in the basement's 45-seated theater. However, the palace entrance road is named after the prince himself Prince Al-Walid bin Dalal. Things didn't end here, the compound features three outdoor pools and a large indoor swimming pool. On the estate, there are many distinct structures, including a mosque, Bill Gates, his old friend Khaldun al-Mubarak, parliamentary delegates from all over the world, and other VIPs are among the most notable guests he entertains. However, the third one is under construction and is going to be a 4 million square feet palace, including a private zoo and a 70,000 square meter lake. Tamim bin Hamad al-Thani Tamim bin Hamad al-Thani who has an estimated fortune of $2.1 billion, is the absolute monarch of Qatar and is much wealthier than Queen Elizabeth. While some people treat themselves to Baskin Robbins when they want to indulge, the ruler of Qatar treats himself to listening to Rick Ross's Maybach music while driving one of his 12 Benz S600 Maybach luxury sedans, which are each worth $516,000. He switches it up with his white, $194,000 Lexus LX570, three $240,000 Bentley Bentayga. And for that show's topping attention, a $500,000 Bentley Mulsanne limo. Amazingly, it costs only a third as much as Joe Biden's beast, but it looks far prettier. There are kind people and then there is this monarch who provides gifts that are more expensive than the Buffalo Sabres NHL team. He once gifted Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan a $400 million private Boeing 747-8. This aircraft's interior included a boardroom, a hospital, and staterooms. It was done to reaffirm Fanny's unique affection for Erdogan.
Busta Rhymes was likely referring to individuals like Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani and his $500 million Al Lusayyot when he rapped about having rap money. The only 33rd largest private watercraft in the world, this 400 foot, 800 ton sea monster has an astounding million dollar net worth and is the height of opulence. Also, it is one of the most luxurious yachts with its European styled furnishing woods and leather trims and extravagant state rooms. With its European styled furnishings, wood and leather detailing, and lavish state rooms. It is also one of the most extravagant yachts which the Emir of Qatar owns.